I'm Ethan Cohen, here in Paul High School's historic big gym. Built in 1928, this building has been home to state champions and pally greats such as Jim Harbaugh, Jim Luskatoff, and Jeremy Lynn. However, under a proposal due to be discussed by the school board Tuesday night, this building could be raised and replaced with a state-of-the-art facility by 2016. Although there is a new gym in the Pally Master Plan, there are currently no funds allocated for its construction. However, a proposal due to be presented to the school board on Tuesday aims to change that and drastically expedite the process. The proposal begins by detailing the outdated state of Pally's athletic facilities, even calling them, quote, some of the least adequate facilities in the peninsula. The proposal then discusses a plan in which $5.5 million of strong school bond funds currently allocated for a new fitness center would be combined with a, quote, major donation from a local parent in order to build a new athletic complex. The district and this donor would then enter into a lease-leaseback agreement, where after the completion of the building, it would be conveyed back to the district. In this way, the process can happen much more quickly than would be normal for a process of this size. The proposal calls for two new gyms, totaling almost 25,000 square feet, as well as separate 5,000 square foot wrestling and weight rooms. These buildings would be built on the site of the current gyms and may result in the redesign of the aquatic center and the destruction of the large gym. Perhaps even more importantly, under this plan, the project would be completed in time for the 2015-2016 school year. In a statement to Infocus, Kim Diorio, vice principal in charge of facilities, wrote that, quote, This is a fantastic opportunity that will benefit our entire community for generations to come. I look forward to working with the team on making this project a successful one for our school. Infocus will be at the board meeting Tuesday night, so stay tuned for more as this story develops. With this Infocus exclusive, I'm Ethan Cohen.